in this video I am going to unbox review and properly test out the cooling cup or also known as the drink chiller which I have bought from Aliexpress so they are calling it the cooling cup and there is a word called quick so I hope uh, I will test it out and then we will see how quick it is so here is how the cooling cup looks I am going to open up uh, it up, uh, up a little bit later on so you can see that so this is how the cup looks from outside and this is where you can use it home office restaurant club bar and uh, original design quick cooling uh, but they missed out the car options like uh, I think they may mainly made this uh, device for the car uh, you'll find out a little bit later on why I'm saying this and uh, and this part is very important product description okay let me just uh, go to these important details especially the voltage uh, the operating voltage of this uh, cooling cup is uh, 12 volt and current is 3 amperes and the power consumption is uh, 28 watt so this detail will be uh, important later on so firstly so let's go ahead and open up the box and see what's inside box let me see so this is the aluminium cup over here so let me just show it to you how it looks so this looks very feels looks and uh, feels very nice very shiny okay this is the user manual over here English and Chinese and um, other details which I don't know what they are and this is the picture of the uh, cooling cup okay so that's gone now let's take out the machine okay I will show you the this the main part in a bit later on so what they provided so there is nothing else in the box okay so what they provided is with this one you can see this is this is uh, this 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 is mainly for the car okay so this part uh, goes into that uh, cigarette hole uh, cigarette lighter hole in the car and this part goes into the uh, like main device so they did not provide me with an adapter so so mainly they made this device for using only on cars so if you're traveling uh, then you can use this device to cool down your drinks so as they provided this only adapter only this this uh, cigarette lighter adapter only so I'm assuming they only made it for cars okay so let's test it out okay okay fine now uh, let's have a look at the main device over here okay now you can see this is the main device okay this is the main machine there is kind of fan at the bottom and uh, there is a power on off LED over here and more place to release the air or something and uh, a kind of plate this is what the cooling effect occurs so what I need to do I need to just keep it over here and uh, put a small bottle of drinks over here put a drinks in this cup or just put a bottle of uh, small bottle of drink over here and then just uh, turn it on so that the drink will cool okay so this is how it works so let me just see in the box over here that 
so it works by a important imported semiconductor refrigeration tip so they are claiming it uh, that is extremely fast refrigeration so i will come to the testing part a little bit later on then you will see whether how good it uh, like how well it works and now that i do not have okay let me just show you to you no okay so now they only as they only provided me with this so to test it out in my home uh, i have to buy uh, adapter so i had to buy so i had to buy this kind of adapter over here you can see this port is like the car cigarette lighter port over here and this is a 12 volt let me see 12 volt uh, 12 volt 5 ampere adapter and the machine works on 3 ampere uh, but uh, it so i have researched it a bit so so i found out that the voltage needs to be the same but if the current when it comes to current it can be equal to the operating current or it can be more so it just takes up as much as it needs from the current and this is where the uh, will uh, this is where the that uh, adapter that let me just show you to you then you'll get it okay okay see it fits uh, fits in perfectly so i have providing the i'm providing the link to you to this adapter which i bought from aliexpress down in the description below and to properly test it out i have i have also bought a digital thermometer see over here digital thermometer and uh, there is a probe at the end i'm going to dip this port probe into the drink and then you'll get the actual actual uh, like the temperature value so that's going to be very accurate so so let's go let's so let's go ahead and test out how it works so okay okay so now i have uh, everything set up and ready to go i have the cooling cup set up and i have uh, three bottles of drinks um coca cola two coca cola coca colas and one sprite i have the digital thermometer over here and uh, i have the adapter uh, connected to the power supply okay so now let me just uh, go ahead and show you how you can power uh, power on the cooling cup uh, power on and off okay so all i need to do is connect this with this as i showed you earlier okay okay see you see the red light turning on great it is a b kind of difficult to get uh, into that you put into that uh, but it doesn't matter it's okay it, it get, I, you can get used to it okay so uh, let me just show you how can power it on and off so you see there there is a on and off just hover over it you see the blue light which means it is turned on just hover over it again you, you don't even need to touch it just hover over it and it will turn on and uh, touch it again or hover over it it will turn off okay so and uh, so you so I'm just going to use coke for now I'm going to use coke so instead of putting the bottle like this I'm going to pour this drink the coke in it to this glass why because I uh, did a demo test earlier and uh, it doesn't cool down the coke at all so because the plastic prevents uh, the plastic prevents the uh, like prevents the like uh, uh, like plastic prevents from uh, from getting it cooled right so the, that's why I'm going to uh, pour this directly into the cup and it will work much better okay and here I have the thermometer over here so let me just turn on and show you the room temperature over here okay now it's 28.1 I have the uh, AC turned on that's okay 28.1 right so so let me just uh, pour the coke into this uh, cooling cup 
and then measure the initial temperature okay so let's go great <coughs> thankfully nothing spilled over okay so I'm just going to pour down this coke over here almost done okay so there it goes the coke So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to use this. So you can see this thermometer has got a probe at that. And I can easily just put it in here like this. See, easily, no problem. So let me just put it as much as I can. So it will go all the way to the bottom. Okay, I think, uh, yeah, I think that's nice that should be fine yeah okay that will be enough okay so now let me just see the initial temperature of the coke uh, the initial temperature of the coke is 29.3 so what I'm going to do I'm going to instead of just tasting for 1 and 2 minutes or 5 minutes or 10 minutes I'm going to taste this for a full, full hour full hour uh, but don't worry like uh, I'm not going to like record this video for an entire hour what I'm going to do I'm going to update you in each uh, 10 minutes after 10 minutes I'm going to update you so I'm going to just uh, update you in six minutes in uh, uh, 10 minutes interval for six times okay so so 29.5 this is the uh, temperature and I, I haven't turned it on yet Great, now it is propylene. Okay, so the first reading over here is 29.5. Great, so let's turn on the machine and see if it cools down okay it's turned on and I have a timer over here so I'm just turning it on to okay so see you after 10 minutes okay so after around uh, after around uh, 10 minutes the temperature dropped from 29.5 to 24.3 after 10 minutes it just dropped to 24.3 degrees celsius and the temperature is kind of uh, dropping fast so let me just show it to you for a few seconds so there's you can see the temperature is uh, right now is dropping rapidly it's falling rapidly you can see let me just uh, try to show it for a minute or two uh, so you can get an idea right now so here is the thermometer you can see the probe over there inserted into that cup so now right now is 24.2 degree celsius over here let me see if it drops any further uh, but it's working it's working kind of fast let me see if it drops to 24.1 in front of you right now so you need to be a bit of patient but uh, for the first uh, 10 minutes the temperature fell rapidly like uh, it uh, fell uh, very quickly to uh, quickly by uh, 5 degrees Celsius you 
that's the cup C it decreased by 0.1 degree Celsius let me just uh, hold it for you uh, for one another minute then it again uh, climbs to it just uh, it just uh, after 10 minutes I think it gets a bit slower like the fall in temperature is trying to decrease let me just show you another minute and then I will get back to you uh, in after 10 minutes Twenty-four point one. Let me see if it drops to twenty-four point zero in front of you. Let me see. No, it didn't. So let me just uh, go ahead and uh, pause the video and update you after 10 minutes again. Okay, so I think. Okay, so there was an issue in the middle. I accidentally turned it off. And now it's I turned it on again, it's decreasing again. So just wanted to show you the, you see how it's decreasing. Now it's 23.7. So in the middle I just hovered about the button and accidentally turned it off. Just wanted to show you how it's uh, the temperature is decreasing. So that blue light must be turned on. So you see it's decreasing, it was uh, 23.8, now it's 23.7, 23.6, so now it's uh, uh, rapidly uh, decreasing again after I turned it on. So I'll just have to be uh, careful of the button, you see how it's decreasing, uh, by it's decreasing by 0.1 like in every 10 second or something so it's kind of working okay so let me just uh, update you after 10 minutes uh, after the second uh, 20 minutes uh, is over so let me pause this and update you okay so after 20 minutes the temperature is now 20.8 degrees celsius so let me write it down Okay, it's now showing 720.7 degrees Celsius. Okay, so now it's still decreasing, and I need to be careful not to uh, turn it off accidentally again. So I just need to keep away from this button, blue button. So now you can see it's decreasing, uh, but I, I think the decreasing temperature decrease uh, will get slower as the temperature gets slower. So you get an idea right now. Let me see if it decreases in front of you. Now it's 20 point and the machine is turned on. Now the decrease in temperature, uh, the rate of decrease in temperature will get uh, will get lower. Twenty point four turned on. Okay. Let me see if it decreases any decreases any further. Twenty point three, okay. And uh, now it will slowly decrease because. 
20.2 okay let me just get back to you after 10 minutes so after 30 minutes i'll get back to you okay updating you after 30 minutes after 30 minutes the temperature dropped to 17.8 degrees celsius and the machine is turned on let me check okay let me write it down 30 17.8 degrees celsius okay and i see they're still dropping right now so it is quite surprising and it's working quite well or to be honest and i did not expect it to work this well so 17.5 degrees celsius right now so i'm going to test it for another 30 more minutes just so can i see that how much can, can it cool can it go to zero degree celsius can it make the drink icy cold so that's what i want to test so this is the temperature you get after uh, 30 minutes 17.5 degrees celsius starting from uh, 29.5 degrees celsius okay so let me see if it decreases any further in front of you 17.4 right now 17.3 decreasing f uh, faster right now very surprising i did not think i did not thought that uh, it will work this well let me see if it decreases any further in front of you Seventeen point two. Wow, it's it's decreasing very fast. I'm very surprised. So I did a demo test yesterday, and um, it didn't work this well. Uh, now it's working very well. So I'm very seventeen point two degrees Celsius. Turned on, and this is going to there over here. Okay, so let me uh, get back to you after forty minutes. Okay, then see how much it goes down. Okay. Great. Okay, checking in after 40 minutes. After 40 minutes, the temperature dropped to 15.5 degrees Celsius. Okay, so if you don't believe me, you can see that the water is condensing around the cup. It is so cold that water is condensing around. Let me just touch it and show you. You see? So let me just show you. Let me see if we. So machine is turned on. So I need to. I'm checking again that the machine is turned on because I accidentally turned it off in the middle. Then I had to readjust, readjust the timer and go there. So you can see the temperature is d decreasing quite fast actually. 15.1. Like it was like 15.5 a while ago so i'm quite surprised to be honest that i didn't expect it to work that well i thought that uh, it was going to get stuck uh, in 19 degrees celsius so it is working quite well and there are a kind of exhaust fan around it and the temperature is decreasing from there let me see if it decreases any further in front of you 15.2 15.3 it's just uh, as I told you before like uh, the as the temperature keeps on decreasing it will get harder and harder for the temperature to get lower okay so 15.2 because it's already reaching its limit uh, it's performing better than I thought so 15.2 degrees Celsius so so it depends on you like after 40 minutes you get 15.2 degrees celsius so is that good enough for you so it's up to you to think that so if you see it's decreased even further 15.1 let me see if it goes to 15.2 and then i'll pause again machine is turned on Uh, I think it's becoming harder for it to 
reduce the temperature any further let me wait a uh, five more seconds if see if it goes to 15.0 let me like 15.0 right right 15.0 okay let me get back to you after 10 after 10 minutes again after 50 minutes okay then we'll see what goes on going on okay checking in after 50 minutes now the temperature dropped to 13.9 degrees celsius you can see okay let me just write it down over here 50 minutes temperature 13.9 degrees celsius so let me see right now so the it's turned on let me check if it's turned on yes blue light 13.8 now after 10 minutes i'll see that uh, if will it uh, decrease like is it going to decrease even further so it just uh, it's just uh, the machine just uh, is working beyond my expectation i thought the temperature was going to get stuck in 18 18 degrees celsius but it just keeps on decreasing so after 10 minutes after one full hour um, let's see what happens after one hour left uh, let's see after 10 minutes i'm going to get back to you with the final 10 minutes you see it just decreased to even uh, by 0.1 degrees celsius so let me pause the video and get back to you like after 10 minutes and after one full hour thank you okay so after one full hour the temperature is now 12.7 degrees celsius okay so let me write it down 60 12.7 degrees celsius okay so let me just go through this temperature again so firstly it was 20 at the beginning it was 29.5 degrees celsius after 10 seconds it dropped by 5 degrees to 24.3 degrees celsius after 20 minutes is uh, around the 10 minute mark i think i messed up uh, i think i accidentally turned it off then i had to turn it again uh, turn it on again and then like set the timer again and then do it once again so after 20 minutes it dropped by like around 4 degrees celsius to 20.7 degrees celsius and uh, after 30 minutes it dropped to 17.8 3 degrees celsius drop and uh, 40 minutes is dropped to 15 degrees celsius after 15 minutes is dropped to 13.9 so after 60 minutes is dropped to 12.7 so and it's still dropping now it's 12.6 degrees celsius so okay so you can see like it depends on what temperature of uh, drink you want so if your room temperature is uh, uh, lower than 29.5 i think uh, it will get uh, it will like uh, it will get colder like uh, it would reduce the temperature faster if you're like uh, actual room temperature is around like 25 degrees celsius or 23 degrees celsius then the temperature redu uh, will uh, reduce faster so that's what i think so in my opinion uh, this machine like uh, this cooling cup or drink chiller exceeded my expectation so like uh, I think the best use for it would be in like in an office like uh, while you're working and uh, you have a cold drink over here and you can just keep the drink on this cooling cup and it would just uh, keep on cooling it okay and uh, so the longer you keep it I think after 30 minutes uh, it's uh, I think like 12.7 is really great I think that's a really cold drink so that's what I think so and uh, so like uh, you can also in my opinion you can also like uh, use it to kill like keep some medicine school but uh, I am not suggesting it like for emergency cases you can just keep some medicine school but it is best for keeping your like 
like uh, drink school or like it's best for use in office and uh, I am not like they mainly made it for car as they only provided me with the car adapter uh, but uh, one thing is that you have to pour the drink inside this cup or else it, it doesn't work properly and uh, if you use it in a car you can use it in a car but like if you hit a bump or something uh, might slash uh, splash all over your car so it depends on like uh, what's your driving like so there it depends on like the driving and uh, so so like uh, i'm providing the links to all these things down in the description below the cup the cooling cup and the uh, adapter over here like the ac power to uh, car cigarette uh, like car power supply 12 volt adapter and also a thermometer this thermometer okay so if you found this video useful please make sure to like this video and also subscribe to my channel and I'm going to keep this thing turned on and uh, and I'm going to like uh, like in the comment section please check for my comment that I'm going to like uh, write down what what's the final result like it does it uh, reach to zero degree Celsius or all, does it get stuck at one point so I'm going to please check the comment and uh, also check the description uh, in the description for the links to these products okay thank you Thank you for your time.